Hi, everybody. Say hi, pup. This is Mariposa. She is the rabbit murderer. This face doesn't look like a killer, does it? Look at this face. Are you so sleepy? Okay, so what we're going to work on today is something that's really cool, which you maybe haven't done before. Um, Google art and culture. All of this like online stuff is definitely necessary because of e-learning. Believe it or not, we are going to be doing some of these activities anyways at the end of the year. Digital art is like a huge part of our curriculum. So luckily it kind of worked out that some of this stuff is like a good fit. So we are going to get you guys started in just a second. Okay, so the next thing that you guys are going to want to do is go out to your internet browser and you're going to want to open Google. Okay, so here we are and in I've just opened my Google Drive and right here in the search bar, I'm going to type in Google, I can type today, arts and culture and it may just pop right up. So you want to click on it, choose it. And right here, the first link is what you want. You're looking for this little icon right there with like the little tower. I don't know why I look like a ghost, like in the camera. So yeah, I'm like see-through. I don't know what's going on there, but hopefully this is good enough. All right, so first thing, I want you to just make sure you kind of click on home and I want you to scroll through and just look at all of the immense enormity. Um, you know, like tons of stuff that, you know, tons of activities, um, you can keep scrolling, but right up here on the top, I want you guys to click on the explore button. Okay. These are the activities that we're going to start with. We're going to do one in art camera, and then we're going to scroll down here and we're going to look at some of the artwork. Now this site changes all the time, depending on like the art that they're kind of highlighting. So first thing, click where it says art camera. It takes you to like a whole new menu of activities. Um, I want you to start right here, 12 artworks you'll love to zoom into, and you're going to click explore. Okay. Now that obviously that picture on my screen, it could be different the day that you guys are doing this. Um, but this is a starry night close up. So I'm going to just kind of like start scrolling through and look, okay, this is like the cool thing. This program will let you zoom in closer to a work of art than if you were even at the museum looking at it. Like in this view, I can even see like cracks in the paint and everything. So I'm going to kind of keep, I'm just like scrolling up and it's going to bring me to like a bunch of different pieces. This is like a sculpture, very cool. So um, to get out of that, I'll just go back to the top of the page and I can kind of just click back on the explore button. Okay. So I want you to definitely do one of those with the art camera to start. All right. Now what you're going to need to do to, for canvas is you're going to have to take a screenshot of one artwork that you zoom into really close. And you're like, Oh my gosh, this is super cool. Like the starry night for me was like amazing. Take a screenshot of that. And then I want you to submit that close up plus the entire design on canvas okay so let's see what that would look like so if i go back to art camera and i'm going to click on right here 12 artworks that you like to zoom into and i'm going to click on the starry night one okay so the first thing i would do is i would on my device i'm going to take a screenshot right there and i would save that as a jpeg and i would upload it okay now i'm going to zoom in to an area that i think is really sweet and I'm going to take a screenshot of that here's my little screenshot so anything inside my little box right there if I was like oh that's really cool because it has like this crack or I really like this yellow or right there some real cool cracks capture that and screenshot that okay and then you're gonna like upload those so that's like the first part all right 